Hello everyone, this video is for anyone who has continued to receive excessive marketing calls from Oak Road Estate or The Wine Group. Oak Road Estate and The Wine Group are the same company and they're a vendor that uses telemarketing to sell wines. Top Drop is owned and operated by the same group. They use high volume, high frequency calls and messages to drive their sales and over the past two years I've received hundreds and hundreds of calls from this company despite repeated requests to be removed from their list. It appears that many Australians have the same problem as me. So in this video, I'll give you an overview of the situation and what actions you can take to address the issue. And I'd also like to use this video to get in contact with other people in the same situation. So a quick Google shows that reviews on sites like Yellow Pages, Product Reviews and Oz Bargains are one star at best. And the comment sections are filled with people complaining about the continued harassment from Oak Road Estate. This includes people like recovering alcoholics and one case a 15 year old who says they've been called multiple times despite telling them that they were under age oak road estate continues to call and attempt to sell them wine at some point the australian communications and media authority acma must have received enough complaints because they started an investigation in 2021 they found that oak road estate had breached multiple spam and telemarketing laws the company was issued infringement notices and they had to pay over two hundred thousand dollars but the investigation refers to only a few dozen instances, which to me seems like a low number. There might be more that are not available in the investigation report, but it does seem like that there are a lot of you out there that may be subject to this behavior, but haven't raised a formal complaint. I asked to be removed from the Oak Road Estate system twice since the ACMA investigation was completed, but they still keep calling. So this means they're either unable or more likely unwilling to improve their behavior. I'll show you the steps that I've taken uh, and that you can take too. It's not going to solve the problem right away, but for government to take further action, we need to make sure we've gone through the proper processes. The first thing to do is make sure you've asked Oak Road Estate or the wine group to stop contacting you. You need to make a note of the date, uh, the time and the number they called you from because this information is critical for escalating the issue if you continue to receive the calls. The second thing to do is get your number on the do not call register. This is free, quick and easy. Registering your number won't stop the calls from Oak Road Estate or anyone else and it does take 30 days for your number to become protected. But after 30 days, if you continue to receive the calls, Make a note of uh, when and what number, and then you can lodge a complaint using this form. If you're receiving spam texts from them, even if you've asked them to stop, you can submit a complaint through ACMA's spam complaint form. But note, this form is for text and email spam only. For telemarketing calls, use the do not call complaint form. Once you've lodged a complaint through either channel, you'll receive a reference number. And from here, we have to wait. If enough people go through this process, we'll have more than one leg to stand on. It's annoying to fill out paperwork, yes, but it's even more annoying to be called by pushy salespeople multiple times a day. Uh, we need to work together to get the word out. So if you or someone else has been harassed by this company, please let us know. I'll post any updates as they come to hand and hopefully we'll get somewhere. Thanks for your time.